Hi guys, in this video I'm reviewing this 2021 Honda Civic RS. So as always, let's get into it. Starting off at the front end, it's got your RS logo, your blacked out front end with the Honda badge. Front LED headlights, front LED fog lights, LED daytime running lamps. It's got your front parking sensors. Not sure what this red is called, but it's a good red. Good look at it for a second, guys. So, whatever that red is called, red is called, it's an awesome red. Your black here. First alloy wheel. It's got your 18 inch alloy wheels with your Michelin tyres. Tyres have stacks of tread left in them. Some of the wheels including this wheel are gas or just this wheel. But gas rash can be fixed by a company called Fixerim. Got your electric folding mirrors. Your RS floor mat. I have a good amount of room in the front as you can see. Door pockets. Your chrome around the windows. Black here. And up on the roof as well. Fuel cap. It locks when you lock the car to stop people from stealing your fuel. Good amount of room in the back as you can see. The dash from here. Flip down centre armrest with two cup holders and child anchorage points in the rear. It's got your 60 40 split folding rear seats. Door pockets on all four doors. Already showed that. Got your spoiler on the back as you can see. Rear parking sensors, reversing camber. It's the Civic. It's the RS. Good amount of boot space. Spare tyre in there. Your shark fin antenna as well. It's a May 2021 build. Here is your 1.5 litre turbocharged four cylinder petrol engine, which create which creates 127 kilowatts of power and 220 newton meters of torque. Cool. Earth Dreams technology, VTEC Turbo. Now we move to the interior. It's got your eight way electric driver's seat, red stitching. It's got your perforated lever. It's 
to place to put your keys. To start it, you put your foot on the brake, press this button here. So let's start with the build quality. I give this build quality a 5 or 6 out of 10. It's got your smooth electric power steering. Horn. This car has 6 airbags for your protection. Engine start stop button lights up red. It's got your electric windows, electric mirrors. Electric folding mirrors, so stops people from bumping them in the shops if you are in the shopping centre. It's got your central locking. Example with the central locking, say you are in a city like Brisbane and the traffic is congested and you didn't feel safe, you can lock the car so you feel safer. Got your leather wrapped steering wheel with your red stitching. It's got your automatic headlights and auto wipers. It's got the Honda logo. It's got your 10 speed auto transmission and your paddle shifters. That's up. And down, you can drive it as a normal drive. And again, you've got the paddle shifters. It's got your leather wrapped gear knob. Econ mode, so it saves you on fuel. Your electronic parking brake. So to release it, you put your foot on the brake, press this button. Then to engage it, you pull this up. Brake hold as well. It's got your free mode reversing camera as you can see. So, you can turn your rear parking sensors off and traction control, button, button for your fog lights as well. So, this car's got your auto emergency braking, full collision light, lane departure warning, lane keep assistant. Adaptive cruise control and the windows have motion sensors too. So, say your arm was in the window, it would sense that your arm is in the window and it won't chop it off. You can lock the rear windows too. Boot button here. This car's travelled 24,000. 
285 kilometers. So it's overdue for its service. That's the service sticker there, as you can see. Your ticket holder. So. This one's for your turbo. So I'll stab the throttle a little bit. It reacted a little bit. So, your speed, the most important one to keep it on because the speeding fines in Queensland are now over $1,000. Yep. Not joking, so very important to keep an eye on your speed at all times to avoid the 1,000 plus dollar fine. Has it? It's got lane watch to this car. So when you turn the left indicator on, or press this button here, it's got the side camber at the side on this mirror so you can see what's around you so it's got your leather wrapped gear knob two factory remote keys so the Honda logo, emergency key in case of a flat battery, lock, unlock, boot button. So, it's got a built-in subwoofer and premium sound system being the RS. I'll get you an example of that sound system now. That's an example of the sound system for you guys. So this car's got iPod, USB, AUX, Bluetooth audio streaming. You can, it's got hands-free calling as well. Tells you the time outside. Tells you the degrees outside. Tells you up here. So it's 36 degrees outside. Climate. And it's got dual zone electronic climate control as well. So I'm on low and my passenger is on 21. You've got direction of air. It's got your front seat heaters. Switch gear feels European in texture. Brush aluminium dash spears. Brushed aluminium door spears. Smooth power steering. Your adaptive center console. USB plug. You've got some storage down here. And again, you've got USB and AUX and stuff like that. You've got Apple CarPlay and Android also. Mm -hmm. 
You've got some piano black in here too. You can also wind the windows down from the outsides too guys. I'll show you how that works. It's the unlock button. And the windows come down. So I'm going to show you the proximity keys now. So you need to have the key in your pocket, walk up to the car, car's unlocked. So to lock it, you press this button here, mirrors fold in, it's locked. And to unlock it again, you put your fingers behind here. All you do now is open this door, climb in, foot on the brake, press this button here. And you're off. Alloy face pedals here as you can see. This is Jordan's car reviews. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe, share, like and comment. And I'll catch you in the next video. Goodbye.